You might be in a situation where your WhatsApp is constantly just not connecting. Now, what does this mean? Well, basically, whenever you make your way over to your WhatsApp application and then you go through and actually like try to you know send messages or you try to go ahead and do whatever, at the very top, it may just constantly be just stuck on that connecting panel and it never actually connects. Now, the way to go ahead and fix this, it's a very basic thing. That basically just means that your internet connection is down or like WhatsApp is down. So the first thing I'd recommend doing is making your way over to your internet connection settings of your device. So you can make your way over to your Wi-Fi, your, your cell connection, whatever, and just make sure that you have a good Wi-Fi connection or a good internet connection at all. If you do not have a good Wi-Fi connection or you don't have a good internet connection, that is basically going to be the problem that you're going to run into. So just double check and make sure that your Wi-Fi and internet connection are good. You can make your way over to other apps, like make your way over to your app store or whatever, and just go ahead and see if it's loading. If everything's loading fine, then you can move on. But if nothing is loading, that basically means that your internet connection is not good and you are basically going to have to fix that before continuing on. So that's the first thing to keep in mind there. Now, if that's not working, I would also just recommend going into your app store or your Google Play store and finding WhatsApp and literally just updating this application. That can be another thing that a lot of people can probably, you know, kind of fix themselves to. So if this application has an update, just go ahead and literally update your particular iPhone and that can or update your particular WhatsApp application and that could very well end up fixing the problem too. If that's still not working, you may just want to go ahead and double check that WhatsApp isn't actually down. So you can make your way over to a website like downdetector.com or is it downrightnow.com, one of these types of websites and you just want to see if WhatsApp is down or Meta or Facebook or Instagram or any of these other applications that Meta owns are down because if those things are down, there's really not anything you can do. You just have to kind of wait it out until WhatsApp fixes the problem. And then it'll go and kind of be fixed. And then that's pretty much all you're going to have to do there. So that pretty much covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much. But definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so